my friends. Let us embark on a journey of discovery and insight, a journey that starts with the most fundamental and profound truth. Begin with God. This simple yet profound statement is the cornerstone of all wisdom and understanding. It is a call to align our lives with the ultimate source of all things, our Creator. Let me ask you this. Is this the day? Is this the year that you choose to align your life with God's purpose and calling? If you believe that God can make a difference in your life today, let us stand together in faith. I will pray a powerful prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him and He shall direct your paths. This powerful verse from Proverbs 3 verses 5 to 6 is a vivid reminder of the importance of beginning with God in every aspect of our lives. It urges us to rely not on our limited understanding, but to trust in the infinite wisdom of the Lord. Each day you wake, each daily task you undertake, let it be a reminder to begin with God. From the moment your eyes open to the world, to the smallest actions of your routine, invite Him into every part of your day. My friends, why begin with God? Because He is the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. He is the architect of our destinies, the painter of our dreams, and the author of our stories. When we start with God, we build on a foundation that is unshakable, a rock that stands firm amidst the shifting sands of time. Beginning with God means seeking His guidance before making decisions, consulting Him in times of uncertainty, and acknowledging His presence in our moments of triumph. It is recognizing that our own wisdom is but a drop in the ocean of His infinite knowledge. In a world filled with noise and distractions, beginning with God is an act of deliberate focus. It is tuning our hearts to the frequency of His voice discerning His will amidst the complexity of life's demands. It is choosing the path of righteousness over the allure of fleeting pleasures. To begin with, God is to walk in the light of His love and truth. It is to experience the fullness of His grace and the richness of His mercy. It is to embrace a life of purpose anchored in the eternal promises of His Word. But how do we start this journey? It begins with a simple yet profound act. Prayer. Our prayer is the bridge that connects our earthly existence to the divine realm. It is the conversation that builds a true relationship with God. It is the key that unlocks the treasures of heaven through the grace of God. Then. God, in His infinite love and mercy, pours these treasures into our lives. As we prepare to pray, let us approach the throne of grace with hearts full of faith and expectation. Let us lay down our burdens, our fears, our doubts, and our dreams at His feet. Let us open our hearts to the transformative power of His presence. This prayer is not just a ritual. It is a conversation with our loving Father. It is an opportunity to align our will with His, to seek His kingdom first, and to draw from the wellsprings of His wisdom. So, my friends, let us pray with boldness and confidence, knowing that when we begin with God, we embark on the greatest adventure of our lives an adventure filled with hope, peace, provision, and joy unspeakable. An adventure that leads us to the very heart of God's will for our lives. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, 
Let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. You may also listen to this prayer daily as you build your faith and come in agreement. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, most mighty and powerful, I come before you at the beginning of this new season of life, lifting high your glorious name. You are the Alpha and Omega, the creator of all things, and the sustainer of life. I stand in awe of your magnificent power and majesty, for you are worthy of all praise and adoration. Your love and grace know no bounds, and your mercies are new every morning. As I bask in the splendor of your presence, I am humbled by the thought of your greatness, and my heart overflows with gratitude. Thank you, Lord, for the gift of this new day, for the breath in my lungs, and for the countless blessings you have bestowed upon me. In the quiet of this morning, I remember all that you have done for me, and my soul sings praises to your name. I thank you for your faithfulness. Even when I have fallen short in your will and purpose, I confess my sins to you, Lord, and ask for your forgiveness. I also forgive those who have wronged me, releasing any bitterness or resentment for I know this pleases you. Lord, as I embark on this day, I declare in the name of Jesus that I am called for a purpose. I am more than a conqueror through him who loves me. I rebuke any form of delay, stagnation, or curse that tries to hinder my walk with you. In the mighty name of Jesus, I bind every plan of the enemy to derail my destiny. No weapon formed against me shall prosper, for I am covered by the blood of Jesus. Father, I pray for divine protection over my life. Guard me from the snares of the enemy and shield me from all harm and evil. Surround me with your angels and let your presence be a fortified wall around me. I stand against all attacks, be it of the mind, body, or spirit. I rebuke any spirit of fear, anxiety, or discouragement, and I claim peace, joy, and courage in Jesus' name. Lord, extend your healing touch to every area of my life. Heal my body from any sickness and restore my soul. I declare that by the stripes of Jesus, I am healed. I also pray for emotional and spiritual healing. Mend the broken areas of my life and fill me with your peace and comfort. I believe in your power to heal and restore, and I receive your healing in every aspect of my life. I lift up my loved ones to you, Lord. Bless them, protect them, and guide them in your ways. Let your favor shine upon them, and may they experience your love and grace in abundant measure. I pray that they too will recognize their calling and purpose in you. Keep them safe from the enemy's schemes, and let your peace reign in their hearts. Lord, as I say this prayer, together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is humbled before you right now. We come in agreement, knowing that where two or three are gathered in your name, you are in our midst. Bless each one of us, guide us in our calling, and use us for your glory. We stand together, claiming victory over our lives declaring that we are more than conquerors through Christ. We come in agreement, 
knowing that where two or three are gathered in your name, you are in our midst. Bless each one of us, guide us in our calling, and use us for your glory. Lord, in this new season of our lives, open doors of blessings and favor that no man can shut. We stand together, claiming victory over our lives, declaring that we are more than conquerors through Christ. Lord, our days and years are in your hands. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. If you were blessed by this prayer, type the word Amen in the comment section below. I declare that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you in the name of Jesus. Remember, you can help us to reach more persons and spread the gospel. You can do this by sharing the video with a friend or family member and by clicking the like button. Also remember to subscribe to our channel for more videos that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. We appreciate all your support. You're blessed to be a blessing. Please feel free to leave your prayer request in the comment section so that we can present them before God for your blessings and victory and so that other believers on the YouTube platform and all over the world can stand in agreement with you and start praying for you right now. Stand in faith with us while we pray. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.